द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक दैट वी नीड टू लर्न और द नेक्स्ट कॉन्सेप्ट दैट वी नीड टू लर्न इज द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट इन द क्वांटिटेटिव एनालिसिस इन फैक्ट यू कैन इवन से दैट ऑलमोस्ट मोर देन हाफ ऑफ द क्वेश्चन दैट कम आर सम हाउ बेस्ड ऑन दिस कॉन्सेप्ट दैट कॉन्सेप्ट इज ऑफ linear equations now uh, this is a concept we'll understand in detail because in a number of topics i mean if you check a book uh, you know whichever books you read uh, there is a book by r s agarwal or arehant or something so you will see that uh, they have di- divided the book in 50 60 odd chapters but at least in half the chapters uh, the questions will be solved eventually by a linear equation so we'll learn the concepts first then we'll go to the question patterns now what is a linear equation first of all ignore linear what is an equation again you know what do you mean by an equation equation means in english equation means something is equal to something else right it's it is a word which has been uh, you know created from the word equal equation means something is equal to something else fairly simple so now linear you know, and whenever it you know when it becomes a problem you know something is equal to something else so now it becomes an equation or we try to use an equation whenever we don't know at least one thing right say for example i tell you that uh, my age currently say for example is if 30 years sorry yeah my age currently is 30 years so uh, 10 years later what will be my age suppose i again the simplest of problem you can all you know all automatically tell it's 40 right but uh, let's say uh, how do we write it as an equation just just giving you a simple demonstration my age currently is 30 years right um, i'll write it as current age and i say what will be my age 10 years later so let's assume that my age 10 years later is x right fairly simple now we all know that 10 years later my age will be my current age plus 10 years right so can we write it as x is equal to current age that is 30 plus 10 can we write it like this that means x is equal to 40 right so this thing is an equation right it's an equation in which there is some you know one thing is unknown and eventually we get to know it so it's fairly simple you know this is how linear equations work why do we call them linear the word linear is important uh, linear means here nothing will be in square that means the unknown the unknown quantity will be having power 1 so if we write x it can also be written as x raised to power 1 power 1 power 1 there won't be any x square or x cube in this because it's a linear equation if it becomes x square it becomes a quadratic equation which will not discuss you know in this part so the x the power of the variable will remain 1 that is the fundamental idea of linear equation right so this is how linear equation works this is the basic idea of linear equation now there is some very specific there are certain very specific ideas very specific rules regarding linear equation now let's let's find out what the, what those rules are number 1 first thing is the number of linear equations you need are exactly equal to the number of variables you have that means you know eventually we want to solve a problem in this problem how many variables were there my age 10 years 